Trying to freelance. The ball is taken away. Trill Williams. Trill Williams can do it all on defense. He doesn't consider himself a cornerback or safety. The Yonkers native prefers the term weapon. Being able to you know, rotate around the field with, with no hiccups. You know, being able to not come up the field and just to line up anywhere that you know the team needs you to line up. You know, that's being a weapon. That's them using me, you know, as a weapon, and that's something that you know a lot of teams growing up uh, use me as, whether that's offense or defense. Williams' hope is NFL teams will view and use him in the same way. The Syracuse defensive back is projected to be selected in the middle of next week's draft. You know, being from Yonkers, you know, a lot of people, you know, don't really, you know, make it out of Yonkers, and you know, I was, you know, one of the few and. You know, just like like DMX, you know, he he was one of the few that, that made it out, and you know it's crazy to, to see a, a guy from Yonkers, you know, touch the world in, in, in that kind of way, and you know I just want to do the, the exact same thing, just you know playing football. What makes Williams special is his natural instinct for the ball. He's done it at the collegiate level at Stepanak High School. Look at this catch he made on his back. It made ESPN's top plays, but where it all started was right here as a 10-year-old. Look at number 23. That's Trill who rips the ball away from the defender. Believe it or not, it started when I was 10. Um, we had went to a, a championship game in Florida, and that was the first time I, I've ever did it. Next week, Trill's dream will come true. As you'd expect, he's pretty anxious about the draft, so there's only one thing that can help him calm his nerves. A lot of Call of Duty. <laughs> a lot of Call of Duty. Uh, so, like, you know, when I'm not working out or... or you know, I just need to relax and you know, hop in the game with uh, you know, my friends from you know back at home or you know, friends I made up at Syracuse. So I'm always, you know, stay connected with them and you know get on the game sometimes. Justin Walters reporting, Pix11 Sports Nation.